Welcome to this tutorial on how to shift gears in a tractor trailer on American Truck Simulator. If you're new to the game or just getting started with driving larger vehicles, shifting gears can seem like a daunting task. But with a little practice and patience, you'll be shifting like a pro in no time. First, let's take a look at the basic mechanics of shifting gears in a tractor trailer. Unlike a car, trucks have a much larger number of gears often up to 18. In addition to the usual five or six forward gears like in cars, there are also several low gears for hauling heavy loads and climbing steep grades. When shifting gears, it's important to pay attention to your truck's RPM gauge. Each gear has a certain range of RPMs where it operates most efficiently. Shifting too early or too late can cause your truck to stall or strain the engine, which can result in damage. Now, let's move on to the actual process of shifting gears. To begin, press down on the clutch pedal with your left foot to disengage the engine from the transmission. With the clutch pedal depressed, move the gear shifter into the next gear, up or down depending on your speed and driving conditions. Since we're stopped here, we're going to put the truck into first gear. I'm using a Logitech G29. Most wheel and shifter combinations should be the same. If your shifter uses the same layout as the Logitech G29, first gear should be all the way to the left and forward. As you release the clutch pedal, gradually apply pressure to the accelerator with your right foot to match the RPMs of the engine with the new gear. It may take some practice to get the timing right, but with time and experience, you'll be shifting gear smoothly and seamlessly. So there you have it, a basic overview of how to shift gears in a tractor trailer in American Truck Simulator. Remember, practice makes perfect, so don't be afraid to spend some time in game honing your shifting skills. That should get you rolling in American Truck Simulator, but if you'd like me to do a more in-depth video, on shifting a 13 speed or maybe even an 18 speed which would involve splitting between the high and low ranges be sure to let me know in the comments if you found this video helpful be sure to leave a like comment what you guys thought and subscribe so you never miss another video I'll catch you guys in the next one